Hello, welcome to Scrap Time, episode 624. My name is Christine, and on today's episode, I'm showing you how to use your 12-inch border dies on cards. Today I'm showing you some quick little cards I made using the border dies, just to show you that even though they're 12-inch border dies, you can still use them in your card making. And this first one is the pennant die. And what I did is I took a piece of white paper and put strips of washi tape, sort of in a rainbow formation. You can see starting with red over here and then went to some purple. And, um, and then cut it out. And then I just added this simple little trim on top. Happy birthday. And you got yourself a quick little card. But then what I realized is I could make a second card with the leftovers of where the die cut in. So if you sort of see here, when you compare them, you can see this fits in here and that fits in there and how it came out. And so I just cut it off in a little angle, put the ribbon there, and I was able to make two cards with my one die cut. That's sort of neat. Here I took the leaf border and just put it behind and did a circle. And this is um, a new 4x4 four four flower die from Lifestyle Crafts with this latest release. So I put that in the middle and then just put the leaf die behind it. Here I made a quick card for my brother-in-law. I'm like, oh, his birthday's coming, better mail him a card. So, you know, we all know men, they don't really care about cards. So you just want to give something nice, quick, easy. I put the, uh, the little diamond border there, added some of the gray and the red, a little happy birthday, and we're good to go. He'll be happy that I just remembered to mail it. And then I just want to point out though that you get these diamonds out of here that you can save these and use them on another project and do like a little patchwork or something. So you can keep all these other shapes that get cut out of your borders. Then I took the little zigzag die and made this little rainbow card. How cute is that? And I had cut the full length of this die so I was able to make two cards. And then this one, I just put them just right side by side versus leaving the little white between them. So again, really simple cards that you can make using your border dies. Well, that's it for today's episode. Be sure to check out my website at www.scraptime.ca. And on our next episode, I'm showing you some new dies from Spellbinders. So please join us. Thanks for watching Scrap Time.